Get ready with me going to work. Work. I just got to put some makeup on. How is everybody doing today? I wanted to say my channel is going to take a slight turn. And I think it's a turn for the better. I've told this to Amy before and other people. I like dumpster diving. But I just don't want to be known for that. And if it takes me a little bit longer to get people, oh well. And I don't see why it should. They got an older lady named Vivian's Van Adventures. Maybe she's doing good because she's living in a van and talking about a van. I don't know. But I don't want to just be known for dumpster driving. Because that's why my name is called Lisa Sharing Life Stories with you. Because there's just so much more to me than that. And I've thought about this from the get-go. Because that's why I named my name. Oh, I'm thirsty. That's why I named my name Lisa Sharing Life Stories with you. Because I'm not just dumpster diving. And I know that gets on Amy's nerves too. Like, not as many people will watch her videos as she does cooking or canning or the animals, and that's a bunch of crock. What I want to be known for is dumpster diving. Just a little, a part of it. Also cooking and also sharing get ready with me this this is how I feel about this or that see a part of my life uh, be a part of my life just sit and shoot shoot the shit as they would say it seems like this mascara was good for my eyes like it didn't bother my eyes but who knows maybe Maybe the Canadian wildfires are better the last couple of days. I don't know. They said we still have problems with it. I rush, still rush like a crazy lady today. I went to take pop bottles back. Everything that's regular price at that Value Fresh supermarket, you guys, is crazy prices. They're... Let me put my glasses on. They're... What do you call those sausages? Um, I don't know if they're Hormel or whatever. They used to be a dollar a package for 10 of them. You make them in the microwave. You see Doherty Dozen's mother, she makes them by the bulk. Um, I thought maybe, uh, I thought maybe at the high end, They'd be like a dollar ninety nine at uh, Value Fresh. They were two ninety two ninety nine, and I told the guy, "This is ridiculous." I mean, when you got great prices on other things, fine, but if you didn't have that, this store would fold because who could afford that? Two ninety nine for ten of those brown and serve. Come on now, those are not worth three dollars. And before the pandemic, they were. 98 cents at Walmart. Exactly 98 cents. <laughs> and then I got another small bag. I guess they call it Potatoes O'Brien with the onions and the red and green peppers. It was $4.30. And it was their brand, like an off brand, our family or whatever. I'm like, you got to be kidding. And I thought Walmart was bad. Because that used to be a dollar eighty-eight those bags before the pandemic. Now they're $4.30 at these kind of grocery stores. That's crazy. That's double and triple. Oh, my God. Because I had one bag, and I'm like, that don't look like it's enough. I like a lot of those hash browns. So does my husband. I mean, I filled his plate like that. And mine, I got a bowl, too, of eggs and a sausage and... I told him never to buy bread that wasn't sliced again. I burned half of the loaf. Half the loaf didn't cut right, so I threw it out to the birds. And I got like four pieces cut. And they're... Oh, my 
God, what a disaster. I go buy frickin' bread today. That's a cut loaf of bread before I kill you. Tomorrow, I'm going to make my version how I do spare ribs. What you do is you boil them. You can boil them even in a crock pot, not to make your house not to make your house so hot. You boil them either, then put them in the oven with barbecue sauce or on the barbecue grill. And I might do the barbecue grill because I'm probably going to put the air on tomorrow, and then I could do a whole batch of hot dogs at the same time and put barbecue sauce on the hot dogs too. So that would be good. So maybe we could eat that two days in a row. So that could be what Tuesday and Wednesday kind of a deal. So then I wouldn't have to. Because i got to cut grass and i got to clean the floors and everything in the house. Yeah. That's the two things i got to do while I'm off. But I'm still trying to dumpster dive. But that's what I want my channel to be. You know, okay, dumpster diving. But also I want to come on here and talk just like this to you guys. Because I feel i got a lot to say, maybe more than most people. Then I want to also cook on here. So, yeah. And that, and that lady's real cute. She's like, at the end of every video, she goes, take the long way home. And she goes, bloop, or some shit. She's a real sweet little lady. She's like 70-some years old or whatever. She's sweet, very sweet. But I, she can talk to you people. I want to be able to talk to you people because, again, I feel that I have a lot to say. And that's why I feel my channel should be versatile. It, it's it's about a little bit about everything. That's why I call it Lisa Sharing Life Stories with you because it's a little bit about everything. So I just wanted to say that tomorrow I'm going to drop off some bags of stuff that I got yesterday to that lady. Give her some stuff. I can't believe she called me and says, are you mad at me? She wants to know where the stuff is. I'm like, lady, I get what I get when I get it. Some days I'll have tons of stuff I won't know what to do with it. And I'm giving it to you and it's overwhelming you. And then there's going to be periods where you're not going to get anything. That's what dumpster diving is about. She, she just don't get it, that lady. So, And then my other friend wanted the other Olive Garden dressing, the vitamins. And I'm going to give her those two little candles. They don't smell, but I thought she could just use them in her house. They're cute. They're just, she could use them. And, uh, yeah. So, I'm soaking in for a minute. I'm going to work. I just wanted to say that I love you all. What do you guys think about my decision? Please, everybody chime in. This is what I want to know. And when I talk, what would you like me to talk about, too? What would excite you guys? What would be interesting? Give me some ideas. That that would really help me out in my channel. And I want my husband to help me with that GoPro on Tuesday and Wednesday, too. We'll see if I can get anywhere with that. But give me some ideas, okay? I love you all, and I should be holding the camera a different way, but I, I don't got much time. I got to go. I love you all. Give me ideas what I should talk about or what would excite you. What would you think would be interesting? Have a great day. Like, love, and subscribe. I love you all. Tell me about your day, bad or good. I want to know. I always answer everybody back. Have a great day. Bye, beautiful people.